Welcome to the word for the day for September 9th, Thursday, September 9th. Title is the Lord said to him, go back the way you came and go to the desert of Damascus. First uh, King 18, 15 NIV. God remedy for depression four. Let God give you new direction. I underline that. God told Elijah to go to the desert of Damascus and anoint a new king as also a new prophet to take his place. See verses 15 and 17. In other words, he gave Elijah a new assignment. Trying to avoid spending too much time focusing on self-pity, get your eyes off yourself and start looking for the needs, uh, start looking for the needs of others. That's good. Try to get involved in their life through a ministry where you're giving out and God is giving through you. If you are constantly looking at yourself, you will be discouraged. Amen. Do not be interested only in your own life, but be interested in the life of others. Philippians 2.4. You say, but if but I fail badly and I disappoint myself. Surely God must be disappointed with me too. Disappointment only happens when someone expects you to do something different from what you do. Jesus knew Peter would deny him, but he called him anyway. Why? Because he knew Peter would learn and grow through the experience and go on to even greater things. God wants to give you a new purpose and a new direction. He is not finished with you, amen? Maybe you blew it, big deal, uh, or big deal, if you let him. God will pick you up and help you to start over, amen? Uh, one minute stake and, or 100, it doesn't matter. It doesn't render you useless to life. Today, God wants to lift you out of your depression. He can help you. He can change you. He can, you don't have to go through life being manipulated by your emotions. Your, uh, your emotions can be affected by your thoughts. And with God's help, you can change how you think and what you think about. Amen. It's all about God. Let him use, uh, you use, uh, Use you in his way if you let him. So you saw, I got out of it. Uh, you have to change your directions. You have to listen to God and, and uh, get changes from him. Um, and we thank you for your your word for the day, Lord. And we give you the praise, honor, and glory, all. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.